Hey, how's it going everybody? Welcome to the Scarecorp channel. Today I would like to show you a video on some NFC stickers and how NFC works and how you can use it with the Samsung Galaxy S3 and which apps to use as well. So first thing, um, I will show you how to turn on NFC. So if you want to go into your settings, more settings, and NFC, make sure that's enabled. When that's enabled, you'll get a little N right there with a little, looks like a wireless sign there. So turn that on and then you're ready to rock. Next thing you want to do is go to your uh, go to your Google Play Store and download NFC Task, task Launcher. Uh, once you download that, uh, this is by far one of the best um, programs out there for um, NFC devices. Uh, so uh, let's just kind of look at uh, what you can do here. So uh, if you scroll over, uh, you can actually buy tags, NFC tags, so you can get them in sticker format or little dongles or, or whatnot. Then you have uh, popular uh, profiles already kind of set for what you want to do and you have your uh, yours created and then also shows you kind of what stats um, as far as uh, how many times I've activated it and how much time it actually saved me so it's kind of a cool little feature so what the stickers look like it's uh, you can get them all different shapes and sizes um, I got these um, online I can't remember eBay or something for like five bucks or five um, and uh, they work they work awesome okay so let's just uh, set up uh, one or two little um, uh, NFC tags here so let's just work with this one so let's say um, you want to set up uh, something for uh, well, let's just kind of see what the templates are here, so and then we can we can choose one. So you have a, one in a car, so uh, you can enable disable Bluetooth, and you can open up any kind of application. So let's say you want to enable Bluetooth and connect to your Bluetooth uh, stereo, and then say you want to open up the Maps app. Um, usually, you would put this sticker on your cradle on your phone, then as soon as you hit it. Bam! It would basically do whatever you needed to do here. So that's the uh, the car one, the office one. Uh, so say if you want to, you're going to the office and you have one by your one of these stickers by your desk, then you just um, say in the office you don't want to be disturbed. You just set the ringer all the way down to nothing. Enable, disable, you know, the Bluetooth. Um, or sorry, the Wi-Fi settings uh, in case you know you don't want any messages or whatnot. And then you have one for home and home again. Uh, you pretty much decide what you want to do there. And bedside, if you want to lower down your volume and um, and maybe even schedule an alarm to uh, to wake you up. So you just tap that. It would create an alarm, and it would set all of these things uh, the way you want them. So let's uh, let's create one. Um, so let's say we want um, let's uh, create one of these. Uh, let's see. Okay, so let's create an office one. So what we're gonna do is we want the volume to be uh, on vibrate. And we want to actually toggle off, uh, so you can go enable, disable, or toggle. We're just going to toggle off the um, um, the Wi-Fi. So maybe we set it on in the car, and we're going to turn it off, um, or we want to toggle it, uh, you know, when we get to the office. So we'll press OK. So that's pretty much uh, we give us our two actions. Here's the total bytes that this is going to write on the card. Um, on the sticker and you might want to read how many bytes yours comes with um, so you can put how many different tasks here so it's we're going to hit save and write then it's going to ask us to place that on the on the sticker so we're going to do so and boom this thing's successfully written so we're going to go back off of here 
Okay, so we told it to turn off Wi-Fi. So there we can see our Wi-Fi is um, on right now. We're going to just set it on top. And now it's activating Office. And bam, now we're in, in vibrate only and our 4G is activated because there's no more Wi-Fi. So we, we basically take that away. And then let's see the reverse of that. It's the office, and our Wi-Fi should come on, bam, and our Wi-Fi is back on. So pretty much easy here, guys. Um, and these are rewritable as well, so it's not a one-time use or anything like that. So if I want to turn that back on, and uh, let me show you one of my, my tags here. So the one for my car, I'm enabling Bluetooth, so I can connect to my stereo. I'm actually maxing out my media volume and I'm launching uh, my podcast um, uh, app uh, for my podcast. So basically, uh, if I want to rewrite that one for this chip here, I will go ahead and hit save. It's going to ask me to put that on. And it's been written. And now, if I want to uh, go ahead and... And you can see, and this might even show us, okay, so Bluetooth right now, just so you know, is disabled right there. We're on Wi-Fi and we're also on silent, so let's see if this will max out our volume as well. So, car, bam, we hit our podcast. And let's see what is done for us here. So there's Bluetooth on. It didn't do anything to the volume because we I told it to turn up the mo media volume, not the speaker um, volume. So or the, the the phone volume. So there we go. Pretty much uh, easy as that. Um, so there's other apps uh, that uh, I have for this guy as well. But uh, here's the other ones I have in there. Um, but this one, the NFC Task Launcher, is by far one of the best ones. So, um, yeah, so that's pretty much it. They're very handy. You can do anything your imagination uh, can think of. So, uh, you know, get some and try them out. Um, they're they're pretty cool. All right. Well, I think that's it for me. Uh, if you like this video. Please hit the like button. I will appreciate that very much. Uh, also hit the subscribe button if you want to see more of these videos uh, when they come out. Um, and if you have any questions about NFC, if you want to see anything else before you make a purchase, um, you know, shoot me down a message below and I will try my best to answer it. All right, we'll catch.